This video, I'm submitting a provisional assisted living facility or assisted living facility with dementia care application as part of a series of videos designed to help applicants submit a correct and complete application. Applicants applying for a provisional assisted living facility, ALF, or assisted living facility with dementia care, ALFDC, license will navigate to the assisted living licensure webpage where they obtained the application. Under the application process heading will be instructions to upload the application to the facility and provider licensing system. Upload the correct and complete application along with all required attachments. Incomplete and inaccurate applications will not be accepted and will be returned by the Minnesota Department of Health, MDH, noting missing application information. No assisted living services can be provided by provisional assisted living facility applicants until MDH issues an assisted living facility license on or after August 1, 2021. Assisted living services can be provided during an application for licensure that results from a change of ownership. Services can continue to be provided under 144A home care license during the conversion application period until August 1st, 2021, when the provider will then begin providing services under their newly obtained ALF or ALFDC license. Once the assisted living facility license application and all required documents are received by MDH, confirmation of receipt of application will be sent to the applicant at the email address given on the application under application contact information. When it has been determined that all required application information and attachments have been submitted, the applicant will receive a request for payment of the license fee. License fees are based on the type of license indicated, ALF or ALFDC, and on the maximum resident license capacity indicated on the application. Instructions for making the electronic license fee payment will be included. When MDH has received confirmation of payment, the application is deemed complete and will proceed to a thorough review process to verify all information provided in the application. MDH has 60 days from submission of a completed application to approve or deny the application and may reach out to request further information if needed. Once the application has been thoroughly verified, including the passing of all background studies and an engineering site inspection, the applicant will receive notification via the email address given on the application under application contact information. The printed license or licenses will be sent to the facility address or addresses listed on the application for posting in each facility. If an applicant provides inaccurate or incomplete information on the application, the Commissioner of Health may deny, revoke, suspend, or refuse to renew the license or impose conditions according to Minnesota Statute Section 144G.15. Questions on the Assisted Living Facility License application can be emailed to health.assistedliving.state.com. Dot mn.us